we're going to talk about some outfield. So right now we're just going to talk about the setup and our foot, our first foot movement towards the ball. So all I want to do is an outfield. I just want to be athletic. I want to be on the balls of my feet. They can be with their hands on their knees, on their hips. It doesn't really matter as long as they're comfortable and they're staying athletic. So now when a ball is hit to me, obviously it can go in any direction around my range. All I want to do with my front foot is take it directly to where the ball is going to go. So say if it's going directly to my left, I'm going to take my left foot and I'm going to point my toes directly in that line of where that ball is going to land. If it's right over my left shoulder, I'm going to take my front foot or my left foot, take my toes right to the ball so it swings my hips open and now I have a direct path for that ball. Over here to my right, direct, or directionally, I'm going to take my right foot, point my toes right at it, right over my right shoulder. Again, I'm going to open up, swing the hips, take my foot, my toes directly to that ball. Where you see a lot of mistakes with kids, they want to take a hop step and then they go. They're actually losing time and they're losing distance off of that first movement with the foot. So we really want to teach taking that first foot wherever that ball is going. If you split that player in half, left, right, they want to use that foot. So if it's off to my left, directional, to my right, directional, over my shoulder, swinging the hips, my right shoulder, swinging the hips. But we really want to focus on that first foot movement in order to get that correct route started.